Hey everybody, it's me, Steve Schnee, the CD Junkie, and I wanted to take this time to talk to you about a concept that I conceived about like maybe five years ago or so, uh, and it's called This Is Ski Lodge. And what it basically is, is as I say in the intro of all my radio shows, it's not a genre, it's a frame of mind. And what my initial intention was, you know, I love like the lounge and exotica scenes. Uh, but I also love sunshine pop, and I love 60s pop, and I love uh, early 70s uh, A&M records type pop, you know, easy listening and vocals and stuff. And I thought, wow, you know, this is the stuff that, you know, I heard on the radio when I was growing up and my parents had in their record collections and uh, friends' families had in their record collections. I thought, well, why not conceive sort of a project that encompasses all of that music uh, and sort of takes you back to a more innocent time? Now, initially, it started just as a Facebook group. Uh, I just called it This Is Ski Lodge, and I would post, you know, a video from uh, Dionne Warwick and then a video from the Beach Boys. And uh, and then it just started growing a little bit, and then it kind of petered out because people weren't really getting the whole concept of Ski Lodge. But then later on, you know, I had uh, a couple shows on Woody Radio, and when I stopped doing those on Woody Radio, I thought, well, why don't I go to Mixcloud, and I'll keep all my shows up there, and I'll make new shows and post them. And I wanted to revive the whole This Is Ski Lodge concept. So I eventually did that a couple of years ago, and I started putting together shows called This Is Ski Lodge. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you just some of the type of music I feature on each episode. Now, the episodes are only an hour, hour and 20 minutes a week. Uh, they are on Mixcloud. But now what I do is I also go on Tuesday nights at 6 p.m. Pacific. I go live on YouTube and I will play an episode of Ski Lodge. And people will come in the peanut gallery and we've gathered together quite a bunch of great people, great supporters, people who love the concept, people who love the music. But for those of you who maybe see that I've gone live or that I have a show posted or uh, something and just don't understand this is Ski Lodge, uh, I'm going to show you just loads of music that will take you back to a certain time uh, and also give an idea of what Ski Lodge is all about. And like I said, I was originally inspired by, you know, all the whole lounge things. Uh, so there's a, uh, a lounge CD. Uh, and, you know, a, lo a lot of the bands, you know, you've got like the Brass Ring and you've got Les Baxter and you've got uh, Peter Nero and you've got, uh, of course, one of my favorites, Esquivel, and another favorite, Dean Elliott. It's beyond Exotica. Um, I mean, Exotica is fantastic and I feature as much of it as I can, but it has to have a certain tempo. So unfortunately, I can't always feature. So a lot of great uh, songs come from compilations like the Sound Gallery. Uh, but then, you know, I also feature like and stuff like Sergio Mendez in Brazil 66. I also feature jazz like Vince Guaraldi. But the real heart and soul of the show is 60s pop. But it can't be too hard. It can't be too rough. It's got to evoke a certain atmosphere, an atmosphere of joy and of, of, of even relaxation and stuff. So you're going to hear stuff like Annette Funicello, Oliver, The Fortunes, Leslie Gore, The Ivy League, Nancy Sinatra, Love. Cass Elliott from the Mamas and the Papas, Freddie and the Dreamers, the Box Tops, the Hollies, Tommy Rowe, Kenny Rogers in the First Edition, the Tremolos, Mike Curb Congregation, Anne Margaret, Claudine Langer, the Carpenters, the Cascades, the Castells, the Crying Shames, Dusty Springfield, Neil Sedaka, Gary Lewis and the Playboys, Lou Christie, Joni Summers, Jackie DeShannon, Liz Damon's Orient Express, Saltwater Taffy, The Honeys, Patience and Prudence. Now, let me stop here before I really get into the heart of what the show is all about. Uh, not all of these bands are featured in one episode. Like I said, I can only fit 28 or 32 tracks in per episode. But this is the type of stuff you're going to hear. You're also going to hear like easy listening, like Ray Conniff and Percy Faith. And one of my favorite crooners, Andy Williams. You're also going to hear uh, Dean Martin, Frank Sinatra, uh, Nat King Cole, people like that. And you're going to hear stuff from our childhood, such as songs from H.R. Puffin Stuff, uh, Banana Splits, Groovy Ghoulies, The Bugaloos, and who can forget the Brady Kids. There's also 60s folk, such as the Journeymen, the Doodletown Pipers, the Wee Five, the Sandpipers, 
and of course many more like the Kingston Trio and New Christie Minstrels. I also feature surf instrumental and vocal, uh, you know, things like the Beach Boys and the Fantastic Baggies and Mr. Gasser and the Weirdos, the Safaris, Jan and Dean and many others. But I think the heart of my show is really uh, the great joyous sunshine pop. The feeling I try to create is really sort of a joyful, innocent uh, look, sort of an escape from, uh, you know, tough times, a way to chill out. I chose the name Ski Lodge because it's a place where people would converge and they'd gather around a fire and they'd uh, drink their mixed drinks or hot cocoa. Uh, and, uh, you know, this is the music I can imagine being blasted through the speakers in a ski lodge. Uh, so let's talk about this joyous, wonderful pop that really forms the heart of what I do. Artists like Tina Mason, Don and the Good Times, Del Shannon, The Collage, The Tuneful Trolley, The Golden Gate, October Country, The Millennium, and Sagittarius, The Circle, Peppermint Rainbow, and also The Peppermint Trolley Company, The Clique, The Vogues, Sunshine Company, The Yellow Balloon, Nino Tempo and April Stevens, The Canterbury Music Festival, Tommy Boyce and Bobby Hart, The Knack, no, not that Knack, this is the other Knack, The New Wave, The Ever-Present Fullness, Thomas and Richard Frost, The Gordian Knot, The Carnival, The Sugar Shop, MC Squared, The Forum, The Blades of Grass, The Bobby Fuller Four, and The Association and The Turtles, or Neil Diamond, Tom Jones, uh, Glenn Campbell, these classic artists that we all grew up with. This is really what formed what This Is Ski Lodge is all about. It's just joyful music. Hopefully the joy that comes out of the music will enter your life and be able to allow you to relax and maybe escape for a little while. That's really what it's all about. Now, like I said, I have a radio show on Mixcloud and I'm going to put a link to the latest episode in the description box below. Uh, and it's also on my YouTube channel, this very YouTube channel, Tuesday night, 6 p.m. Pacific. Uh, I get on and I play the latest episode uh, and I interact with people in the peanut gallery and it's a whole lot of fun because we all learn about the music that's being played and the listeners offer so much insight and it's just a great time. I hope that I sort of explain the concept here and I hope that maybe you check out Ski Lodge. Uh, like I said, if you just want to listen to the music, you can go now, click the link in the description box uh, for the latest episode, which is episode 31. And if you want to hang out with me and a bunch of great people here on my channel live on Tuesday nights at 6 p.m. That would be great as well. We welcome you and it's really a whole lot of fun. So I appreciate you for allowing me to take time to talk about This is Ski Lodge. I hope I got a little bit of the idea across uh, and I hope I didn't bore you too much. But thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you so much for your support for my channel and for uh, all of my projects, including This is Ski Lodge. Remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, and to ring that bell for future notifications. And until the next time, remember me. I'm Steve Schnee, the CD Junkie.